Put your low back to the bank and roll, turn on the channel, hold this young nigga off his crime, but he don't skate. Before the video starts, be sure to give it a thumbs up, subscribe as well. Now with NBA 2K20 just around the corner, we got a little bit under a month, NBA players have already figured out their overall 2K ratings now. And for the most part, every year we get a whole bunch of players complaining who feel they should have had a much higher rating than what they got. And in fact, just recently Hassan Whiteside posted on Instagram about how he feels he should have had a higher rating. I'm telling you, some of these players say they don't care, but deep down, that 2K rating means a lot to them. And just recently, Montrez Harris, who had a standout year of his career last year for the Clippers, was rated an 83, just one behind Kyle Kuzma for the Lakers, where he was rated an 84. Where Harris went on Twitter to, I guess, express how he feels about it. Now, at first, I was like, what the fuck is Harris talking about? Kuzma should be a higher with no debate. But after looking at it again, Kuzma averaged more points, but Harris averaged more rebounds, steals, blocks, with a better field goal percentage, playing more regular season games, averaging fewer turnovers, all while doing this in less minutes than Kuzma. So what Harris is arguing is that he had a legit better year than Kuzma. That's not really far off. I mean, he was a six man of the year candidate. However, how 2K has always rated these players has not only been about their performance on the court. It's also a mix of quickness, speed, strength, vertical, potential, offensive and defensive awareness, hustle, and a lot more. Basically, the intangibles in which 2K gave the edge to Kuzma. Now, I'm not going to sit here and debate this too much as it's not too big of a deal, but I do want to know what you guys think about this. Should Harris have gotten a higher 2K rating or at least a higher one than Kuzma? In the comments, let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to follow me on Instagram, and I'll see you guys later.